So guys, for the first step, you're gonna head over to search and type in task scheduler. Click on it. And then once you're on this, on the left-hand side, you wanna expand task scheduler library. And now you wanna expand Microsoft. And now you wanna expand Windows. And now you wanna scroll down so you find Windows Defender. You wanna click on Windows Defender. And then once you're on this, I'm just gonna expand name. Now you wanna find Windows Defender Scheduled Scan. You wanna right click on it and then click on Properties. Now you wanna to go to Conditions. And then once you're on this, you wanna tick this Start the Task Only if the Computer is Idle 4. You wanna tick this. You wanna set this first box to one hour and then the second box to two hours. And then click on OK. And then once you do that, now you wanna right click on Windows Defender Scheduled Scan again and then click on Properties. And now you want to untick Run of Highest Privileges. You want to untick this and then click on OK. And now for the second step, you want to head over to Search again and type in Virus and Threat Protection. Click on it. And then once you're on this, we're going to click on Manage Settings. Now we're going to scroll down to we find Exclusions. You want to click on Add Remove Exclusions and then click on Yes. And then once you're on this, you want to click on Add an Exclusion. And now you want to click on File. And then once this comes up on the left-hand side, you want to scroll down and then click on this PC. Now you want to find a drive that has Windows installed on it. It's going to have the Windows logo on it. That's how you know it's the correct one. You want to double click on it and then click on Program Files. Now you want to scroll down so you find Windows Defender. Here it is. Double click on Windows Defender. And then once you're on this, you want to scroll down so you find MSMPENG. Here it is. Make sure it's the correct one. It's going to be having a picture like this. It might also say for you MSMPENG.exe. That's also going to be the correct one. Just make sure that it says this and that this is the picture next to it. And then click on open, which is now going to add it right here. And then once you do that, now we're going to click on add exclusion again and then click on file. And then once we're here, you're going to scroll down and then you're going to find it again. This right here, you want to click on it one time. Just click on it one time. Now you just want to copy this. So you're going to highlight this, right click on it and then copy. Now we're going to close out of this. Now we're going to click on add exclusion again. And then you want to click on file type. Now you just want to paste it right here. I'm going to right click and then do paste and then click on add. Now once you do that, you just want to restart your computer and then the problem should be fixed.